We are here today in central London in King's Place for a very exciting moment in music education because we are launching the world's first gospel music graded exams and we're doing that in partnership with the brilliant Gospel Music Industry Alliance and we are making a whole host of gospel luminaries from the UK into new fellows of RSL Awards so that they are helping and advising us to make sure that we produce the best and most authentic gospel music grade exams in the world. Tonight is truly an historic night. For these organisations to come together and create history is something that hasn't been seen before in this country and possibly in the world. It's well overdue and I think that gospel has been um, the bedrock of um, contemporary music for at least four decades from the Windrush generation and the impact that we've made in popular music. And I feel that it's about time that it now embraces us as a art form. There does come a time when it's only right to recognise the input that people have had, not only within the genre of gospel music, but within the entire music industry itself. I mean, we are confident that 60 to 70 percent of pop musicians are supported by gospel music professional by way of vocalists, bands, yes. A and R, yes. tech, yes. especially in live music. And up 